yoga, you're always practicing and you're always trying to be the best in a certain position or a posture. Going into running a business, I'm able to remain calm, collected, persevere. So, you know, there might be some extraordinary occurrence that happens, devastating. But then you step back, you know, let me take my time, solve the problem if there's, you know, this issue. I've played soccer since I was four years old. I'm a really competitive person as well. I play on a men's league, and it really puts me outside of my comfort zone. Between soccer and owning and operating a business, there are a lot of really high stress times that I have to deal with on an individual basis. I'm able to be very diligent because of that calm mentality that I've developed in soccer. Me and Christina were born in Michigan, actually, and we moved here in 1997, so I was 13 and she was nine. We basically grew up in Las Vegas, so we've been here off and on since 97. We came to build the bar in Las Vegas, and here we are. I think what compelled us was just the unknown. Because we were so young, we were really motivated to do something for ourselves, and even though we had no experience in this field. I think that made it actually a little bit easier because we're just so motivated to create something special. And because we were raised in Las Vegas, we had left for several years, came back. It was the perfect opportunity to bring something interesting and cool to our city that we grew up in. Well, I was actually traveling outside of the U.S. when I came up with the concept of Velveteen Rabbit, and the name was one of the first things that I even thought of. We really want to go with a Victorian theme, but also have like a worn and feel, a familiar space. I think it's important to have a design-driven business because they have a connection with our business more and our model. The people that it really speaks to, they'll continue to come back because they find those elements that are interesting. Absolutely. I think that design is really important. Not only connect with the space, but they connect with us in that human element that's prevalent within the, the bar. It was really important for us to come together and choose each and every detail that came, comes into the bar. Everything from Buddha chandeliers or the tap handles that are gold mannequin hands, everything we thought about really thoroughly. And then it gave us more of an opportunity to collaborate with artists and designers. We really wanted to tie that into our whole business model. We paired up with Hernan because, well, he was always a big fan. Hernan actually approached us and he offered this idea of having a zine menu. And we thought that was so cool. We really wanted to focus on working with local people. If I were to give advice to a young creative, just go for it. Pursue your dream and don't let anyone tell you that you shouldn't. Don't get caught up in comparing yourself to other people. If you get caught up in comparing yourself to those people, you're going to lose sight of yourself and what you want. If you stick with it, you're, you will get it. I mean, I have no doubt about that. Keep pursuing. Yeah, don't give up. Yes. <laughs>